Alright, welcome back to another episode of my movie review series. Episode 55. Now, a couple days ago I said that I was going to come back and do another Child's Play film, and here it is, right here. Now, this movie is a little bit different. This movie is called Curse of Chucky. Yeah, 2013, this movie was not released in theaters, unfortunately, but it was uh, a straight-to-video feature. Unfortunately... But you know, you know, this movie it was a uh, it was really a long time coming. I mean, you had this movie, and um, between this movie and the last movie that they had, Seed of Chucky, it was uh, <laughs> it was yeah. Quite a, a gap to uh, to bridge. Yeah, it was indeed long time coming, and <laughs> just like the uh, the review said on the uh, the bottom of the uh, case, Chucky is back and better than ever. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I tell you, man, this movie. You know, I'm telling you right now, I'm already going to give it a perfect five out of five right now. Right now, you know, it's full of jump. I'm giving it a perfect, a perfect five out of five. Because, yeah, this, <laughs> yeah, Chuck, yeah, he came back. He was better than ever. But, yeah, I tell you, though, you know, the way this movie played out, though, it was, it looked like it could have been a reboot, but it turned out to be a sequel. I mean, you know the way the movie, yeah, the way the, the movie played out, man. Yeah, it looked like it looked like it could have been a, a reboot, but it, it turned out to be a sequel. And yeah, that was just genius, man. Pure genius. I mean, Don Mancini, you know, he wrote. And directed this movie, and he's also the creator of the whole Child's Play franchise. Man, I mean, yeah, this right here, this, this is his baby. So yeah, you know, it's awesome, man. This movie is awesome. You know, he, he had um, he had. Oh wow, you know. I'm just uh, blown away by this thing. But yeah, you know, he had um, a lot of uh, surprises in this movie. I mean, well, I suppose, you know, I can give a whole lot of spoilers since everybody that have pretty much got Netflix, you know, I'm sure you've seen this movie because it is on Netflix right now. So, you know. <laughs> Yeah, you know, so yeah, uh, you know, the uh, realization that this is a sequel, you know, when uh, Nika's sister peeled off the uh, the plastic, you know, peeled off his lip, and you saw the uh, the, the scar stitching that Tiffany did for him in Bride of Chucky, you know, you saw that. Peeled off a little bit on the on the side of his face here. You saw more of that stitching. Yeah, I tell you, man. I mean, before you know, he was just you know nice and clear. You know, the old good guy dog. You know, but then you know, as the uh, the movie commenced, you know, he peeled off the uh, peeled off that plastic the excess and you saw the stitching there you know that was just 
there, but I first saw it, man. I was just like, oh my God. <laughs> This is awesome. This is actually a sequel. I mean, this is this is a real continuation. Okay, I mean, you got a great combination of child's play and blank of Chucky. You know, <laughs> this is great. So yeah, you know, this was um wow. You know, you know, me sitting here talking about this, I'm still blown away by this movie. I'm still blown away. I mean. 2013, this movie came out on video, and I was still blown away by it in 2017. How crazy is that, huh? You know, 2013, and then, and then what, four years later, I'm still blown away by it. Crazy. Craziness, man. But yeah, I tell you, though, yep. Yeah, this was a long time coming, and thank God it, it was here, man. It can't, th thank, thank God it came. But yeah, I tell you, though, you know, <clears throat> you know, lucky in, um, the first Elm Street film, I'm going to pull out some, uh, some, 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 some good moments from this movie. I mean, you know, <laughs> little girl Alice, you know, she's, uh, Chucky's new best friend, you know? <laughs> so yeah, you know, thunderstorm, you know, one night thunderstorm, you know, Alice, she can't sleep because, you know, she's a little girl, you know, you know, Mostly kids are afraid of thunderstorms, so you know, yeah, she's had an, another cover, so you know, she's a, uh, you know, she's saying, you know, Chucky, I'm scared. <laughs> and next thing you know, you know, Chucky, you know, he just sitting there, as, as a good guy, dog, he just sitting there, and next thing you know, you slowly see the change. <laughs> you. Fucking should be. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> yeah, right there. And right there, man, that is when the fun really started. You know, that's when the, uh, that's when his killing spree started. Right there, that stormy night. <laughs> so yeah, you know, you know, Got Nika's sister, you know, <laughs> saying, yeah, he have your mother's eyes. They're both too fucking close together. <laughs> Jump that knife dead into the eye, cut it out. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, man. Some awesome shit. This movie, I tell you. Oh, yeah. Whew. I said, yeah, if you've seen this movie on Netflix, then you have not seen the unrated version. I, I recommend you getting the, the Blu-ray, DVD, Blu-ray, whatever. I'm rec I recommend you getting that. The way it was originally intended to be on uh, Blu-ray, DVD, Blu-ray, on video. I recommend you getting that. So, yeah, man. <laughs> this movie, though. Hmm. One of the surprise, one of the, the surprise hits for me, anyway, one of the surprise hits that came out of that year, I mean, one of the surprise hits, maybe the surprise hit for me, I mean, the way you just, the way everything just played out, man, I just couldn't believe what I was seeing, I mean, this is just pure awesomeness and then you know you got like pretty much three endings of the movie you know you know Nika you know she, the wheelchair bound girl because you know she's um she was born that way unfortunately because you know Chucky stabbed her mama's wound <laughs> when uh, back when he was um Back when he was human, you know, back when he was just Charles Lee Ray, you know, yeah, he was a friend of the family. So, you know, you know, you know so, you know, when uh, her dad died, I wonder how. But yeah, when her dad died, you know, he was uh, pretty much the caretaker of the family. So, you know, he was a. Uh, <laughs> Taking care of the mom, and he one night he uh, was about to go and take 
you know, and, and get um, Nika's sister, you know, um, damn, what's her name? <laughs> he about to go and get her sister, you know, from daycare. But, you know, mom stopped her and mom kept her, kept him there. Because, you know, she just wanted a few more, more minutes with him, you know. Basically, she would just send him up because the cops were on their way. So, you know. And this was a great tie in to the first movie because, you know, he, we all know what happened in the beginning of the first movie. I mean, I made a fucking review about it. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> we all know what happened in the beginning of the first movie. So. With all of that, that played out, you know. You know, at the end of at the end of this movie, you know, yeah, Nika, you know, she's the uh, sole survivor, and they uh, deem her to be criminal, criminally insane. So yeah, because you know. Psst, who gonna believe that a, a dog came to life and killed all those people? You know, she's the only one that survived. So, you know, she's the one. Obviously, she did it, right? <laughs> yeah, if you're on the outside looking in, yeah, she did it. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, you know, she's rendered criminally insane. So, this threw her in the loony bin. <sighs> so, you know. You know, when they, they was rolling, rolling her out the courtroom, you know. Run her past evidence A, B, C, and D, which is Chucky. You know, she's saying to, uh, she whispered to Chucky, yeah, I'm still alive. <laughs> yeah, so, you know. Yeah, I'm sure he'll keep that in mind. So, yeah, man, I tell you, you know, well, with that ending, and then he had another ending that, you know, yeah, the cop, you know, he had Chucky in the bag, and you know, he was going to get some money out of it. But, you know, you know, sitting in the police car, you know, he calling this dude on the phone, you know, yeah, make sure you get my money, you know. So, yeah, next thing you know, oh, Tiffany from Bride of Chucky, you know, she shows up in the back of the car, slits the cop's throat. <laughs> Tiffany, where the hell does she come from? <laughs> man, oh man. But hey, since we learned, you know, Tiffany, you know, she's not a doll no more. You know, she's um Jennifer Tilly, um, possessed. You no, know, she's uh, she had possessed Jennifer Tilly's body at the end of um Seed of Chucky. So. That's the tie into that movie. <laughs> so, you know, Tiffany Schneider, Donna Moore, she's Jennifer Tilly. <laughs> you know, considering the fact that Jennifer Tilly played Tiffany. Uh, okay, anyway, I don't want to get into that. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> yeah, and I don't want to get into that either. It's going to be the next review. But anyway, yeah, um. <clears throat> Yeah, how is Chuck getting around? Well, apparently Tiffany is uh, shipping him around in a gift route to another person. Another person just happened to be Alice, you know? After Nika is sent away to the loony bin and the rest of the uh, the family is killed, you know? Alice, you know, they told, that, they told the poor little girl that Nika, yeah, Auntie Nika is, you know, she killed. Her mommy and daddy. <laughs> so, you know. Yeah, so, you know. <sighs> oh, Chucky. Shipped to the, um, to where Alice is, and he, uh, start to play a little game. Not hide and seek, no, not this time. A little game called Hide the Soul. Ade to eat, Bella. Give me the power, I beg of you. The word of Shien of Ashayo. Sukus it to him, and what him what. You know, that game, you know, hide the soul. I swear, oh man. 
<clears throat> God damn you, Chucky. <laughs> and then, you know, that's ending number two. Ending number three. Post credits, like it's a Marvel movie. Ending number three. We see our old friend, Andy Barkley. Played by the actual cat that played Andy Barkley, Alex Vincent, you know, all grown up. You know. <laughs> and you know, and you know it's very obvious, you know, even though he got a nice nice little full grown beard here, it's very obvious that that is Andy Barkley, you know, the little six year old boy, all grown up now. But you know, you're not supposed to know that because us old folks know we tend to forget a lot. So, you know. So, you know, the, uh, you know, the way that scene played out, you know, you know, oh, Andy, yeah, he gets a nice big package, you know? So, you know, he takes it up to, uh, takes it up back to uh, his apartment, you know, he gets a call from mom, you know? So, you know, you see, you hear him on the phone, and then you see in the back, you know, the package getting cut open, you know? Yeah, old Chucky is coming for Andy, gonna finish some old-fashioned business. <sighs> yeah, so, you know, we take a nice little look at Andy's room. You see pictures of Kyle and he and Mom back when he was a little boy, you know. And we're thinking, oh, my God, that's Andy. You know, Andy's all grown up, you know. Because, you know, us old folks, you know, we tend to forget a lot. So, you know, we're not supposed to know that it's him until we see that picture. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, you know, yeah, just, you know, he, he, he turns around. You know, Andy's off the phone. He turns around and he sees a the barrel of a fucking shotgun. You know, play with this, Andy. Boom. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> yes, I tell you that was one of the best endings I've ever seen, boy. <laughs> Not only Andy, you know, he came back, you know, but he, he was on top of things, man. He knew Chucky was going to make his move sooner or later. <laughs> and he was ready for him, boy. Yeah, took that shotgun dead to his head. <laughs> but yeah, I tell you, though, yeah, like I said, man, I give this movie a five out of five because it is just so awesome. So 100% awesome, okay? Um, you cannot, you cannot deny me on that. You cannot deny me that this movie brought it back to the original Child's Play. You cannot deny me of that, okay? This movie is awesome. That's all I can really say about it. Yeah, Chucky's back and he's better than ever, and this was the shit. So yeah, man, yep. Yeah. That's my review, and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> so, yeah, man. A couple more days, I'm going to be coming back here with episode 56. Another Child's Play film. And who else? <laughs> You should know what it is. I ain't got to tell you. I don't got to tell you in the next one. I just get started with it. But yeah, check out my shit right here and subscribe to me right here. In the meantime, in between time, Jack. Show.